So, um, what happened is, um, it was this one in particular day, you know how you can, uh, if you look for a spiritual person, right, you can, uh, determine when there's good spirit, like, I had to learn about good spirits and bad spirits when I was there, and there's not a lot of people that have good spirits, but, what I like to do is like to play the, I like to play the piano in the postal boxes. Okay, so uh, I was playing piano, piano in the postal boxes, right? And uh, now depending on who owns the postal boxes, I didn't really realize that like people actually own the postal boxes. All right, so I learned that. I learned a whole lot from the USPS, actually, just from state to state or whatever. But it reflects in the UK, though. Because when I'm trying to fix something, it's like, I'm on this side of the earth. But I'm trying to reach out to the, uh, the opposite side of the earth, USPS. Okay, so then that's just how I do my work. And that's what I call this God's work. Okay, so it's like the, I guess what you could say, the opposite of a Jehovah Witness when fixing, like, uh, the government buildings or whatever. But anyway, I was dancing at this, um, park. Um, uh, one time I was dancing at the park, there was a whole bunch of birds. And for me dancing, the birds, like, did, like, a design. Um, I, I went to this other park, and I was dancing, and, uh, well, it wasn't a park, it was like, like somewhere, it looked like somewhere where a marching band would go, and they would get on the field, and they would dance, do their dance, so every day around the same time, I went to the, uh, field, and I would dance. Okay, um, this one in particular time I went to go dance and I saw fire come from out the woods, okay, like fire, like a lot, it looked like a whole lot of people, like lit, like, like, like it was like a wood, like a piece of wood. And it, and it was fire coming from out the opposite side. And when you're not a spiritual person, you know stuff about spirits and stuff, that's what you could bring towards you. Okay. So I was doing, I had the tarot cards. And I ordered the tarot cards, but I haven't gotten them yet. There's one in particular pack of tarot cards. Right, and I reordered them, but the people scared the crap out of me. They came from out the woods, fire. Okay, not too long after that, like that evening, I walked into a couple of people's houses that was junky, like that was really, really junky, and their houses was clean. But this girl told me a story about the Indians, right. And I was like, so when do things supposed to change? Right? So she was like, well, I don't know if they look at it like that. I was like, well, if, I, if there's cigarettes, like Indians have cigarettes. I said, well, their cigarettes are cheaper, right? Then, why, what is the problem with uh, us as black people want to purchase their cigarettes if they're cheaper? All right. But I think that it got something to do with the, the government or something. So, like, I could talk to the Indians. That's what I learned. Like, I must can talk to, like, the Indians and, and the spirits or whatever. Like, and I'm trying to be, like, an expert at it, actually. All right? So, people that came from out, out the woods with fire. It's first thing. Okay? So, then somebody lit me on fire. From head to toe. Okay. Okay. After that experience. And. Uh, 
New York and Paris Peace. It was like it's time for me. I was already, I already ran scared from Virginia to uh, New York. Okay, so then after that experience of being lit on fire from head to toe, it was like okay, uh, it is time to go. Like I'm not safe nowhere. Like there's nowhere where I can feel safe at, and no matter who, what, when, where, how, something we're stupid or retarded is going to happen and it and it's just like when do we come at peace you understand what i'm saying just when are we at peace that's why i be thinking something wrong with my puppy too like i just can't enjoy the things in which i want to have without something dumb happening you know so it's like I'm learning about the gifts in which God gave me. Okay. So, to say, if my teacher was the head Indian, right? My teacher was trying to show me that your name is not right in the system. Right? And I'm going to give you the example of the, of the sheet of paper on Google or why your name is not correct. Because I have developmental issues. It's going to be hard for me to actually comprehend what the teacher was saying to me. But eventually, one day, the teacher will clarify what it is that he is trying to tell me. Okay, so what the teacher is trying to tell me is this. The Spencer family, there's a man and a woman that is married, and they have three children. Okay, but all of their children have the same last name. In your family and household, right? Your name goes with your mama and your daddy name. So what that means is, is that your name is wrong in our system. Okay? So that is what I learned from the teacher that was teaching me in the spiritual world. Alright? But see, when you have to be a strong believer in what you're doing. Okay? So, then how I create magic within the post of ops and with the spirits and the Indians. It's a profound thing. And I appreciate them. You know, but when you first start, when people are teaching you, and, and I want you to know, on several different levels are people teaching me. Okay, but I have to sit down and actually think about it. So, I do have people that can save me. Like, if something happened, okay, somebody can come save me. And tell them, tell whoever the people is in the room, how they are wrong. Okay? That, okay, so I want for people to know that, no, I'm not Beyonce. No, I ain't nobody. I'm myself. But I have people that will come and save me. At any situation so if somebody tried to get me locked up there are people that's gonna come and save me right my love